Good morning, everybody. Good morning. 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 Good morning.
At times it will make you feel frustrated, at times angry or irritated. You can also have a feeling of out of control. What's the feeling for you? There's always these things that I want to do so much more. Itna hai, utna hi ho hai, to na kaise ka. With your to do lists, morning list, one at the sham, they say that the good way. Most important thing is how does it make you feel? We sometimes a feeling of hopelessness and helplessness. कभी ऐसे लगता है ना जैसे 24 घंटे भी दिन में कम है इतना भी टाइम मिले कम ही पड़ता है तो जब ऐसा होता है तो क्या फीलिंग आती है 
Sometimes there could be a feeling of guilt because you're not able to give enough time to family. Let's take two more rounds. Are you able to stay focused on the most important things in the day? Or do you get stuck in the small, small things? And the big things, the important things stay behind. Okay, let's take one last round. Feel the feelings. What do you feel when you feel stretched? Okay, take three deep breaths and let's complete the process. Keep your eyes closed for a few moments. And slowly open your eyes, have some water. A lot of tapping required in time management. At time today, you should do more tapping. We'll do this for a couple of days, you know, so that all the patterns around time management are released. Okay, wonderful. So we're going to be grateful. What are we going to be grateful? 
we are going to be grateful for whatever we are able to accomplish in it. So, you get up in the morning, you make a list and you are still able to finish a few things. So, be grateful to God for at least giving you the strength to complete whatever you can. So, we always write a victory log. Today, let's be very thankful to God for the capability of completing tasks. That's our deepest gratitude. Also, be grateful for something that you wish to have in the area of time management. You can say, Thank you, God, that I am an excellent time manager, that I can manage my time so beautifully.
Let's take one more minute. Finish, you can just gently close your eyes and just be grateful. We will be able to manage your personal, professional life. You have enough time to do everything you want to do. Or in, in a sense of control, you can be grateful in advance for all of this. Thank you, thank you. Okay, we're going to seek some forgiveness from God. Let's deeply connect with the Creator. Dear God, if I have hurt anybody, knowingly, unknowingly, directly, indirectly, in this life or any of my previous lives. My thoughts, words or deeds, I seek forgiveness from the bottom of my heart. Please forgive me and release me from all those karmas. We know that everything that's happening in our life today is a sum total of whatever we have done till today. All our thoughts, all the words, the behavior that we have done so far, our actions, all of that is basically is what we are experiencing today. So if there is something not so good happening right now, it could be some because of something that we did in the past. We don't need to know what it is. We can always seek forgiveness from God. Including myself. Directly, indirectly, jane and jane me, is janam me, pitch like kisi bhi janam me. Agar mene kisi ko bhi mere shabdo ke dwara, vicharo ke dwara, phir mere actions ke dwara, agar mene kisi ko bhi hurt kiya hai, to mein tehe dil maafi maangta hoon. Please mujhe maaf kare, sab shama kare, aur mujhe in karmo se mukti dijiye. Thank you, thank you, thank you. We all know that God is very, very kind. God is nothing else but unconditional love. So visualize his beautiful, unconditional love coming down in the form of a beautiful divine white light. Falling on all of us like a beautiful waterfall. Covering us inside and outside, entering the body from the crown chakra, filling up the entire body. Feel this unconditional love flowing through your entire body, flowing through all the 50 plus billion cells. You can visualize the structure of the cell. And this unconditional love flowing through the cells. 
And as it is flowing through the cells, it is healing us physically, mentally, emotionally and spiritually. Remember, unconditional love is the most powerful healing energy in this entire universe. Unconditional love can heal anything. So, Paramatma ke is kar ko mehsus kariye, so feel kariye. Know that God loves you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Now, just let us be in deep meditation for some time. Just stay focused on your breathing. Thoughts are coming in your mind. Do not try to stop thoughts. Let them just come and go like the clouds in the sky. Your focus should only be on the tip of your nose. Now to go to a deeper level, I will count down from 10 to 1. And as I count down to 10 to 1, with each count, you will go a thousand times deeper into your subconscious mind. And at the count of 1, you will reach one of the deepest levels of your subconscious mind. So starting with 10, Nine, eight, seven, going deeper and deeper, six, five, with every count you're going a thousand times deeper into your subconscious mind, four, Three, two, and one. You're now in one of the deepest levels of your mind. You may now transport yourself to one of the most beautiful places on planet Earth. Place that you truly love. 
ऐसे आप वहां पे पहुंच जाते हो तो आपका मन बहुत ही शांत हो जाता है कौन सी ऐसी जगह है थोड़ा सोचिए महसूस करिए कि आप वहां पे पहुंच चुके हो As you find yourself in that beautiful place, your mind becomes more and more relaxed. You are now in the deep alpha state of mind. Alpha state of mind is a very highly beneficial state of mind. Whatever you visualize and affirm in this state of mind comes to physical reality. इस अवस्था में आप जो भी मनोचित्रण करते हो, जो भी स्वास्थ्यचित्रण करते हो, वो चीजें आपके जीवन में सच बनकर ही रहती हैं. So now visualize your goals. Act with your health goals. Realize that you have achieved your health goals. Physical fitness is at its optimal level. Body is full of energy, vitality, radiant, vibrant, powerful. Full of energy. You're looking exactly the way you wanted to look. You achieved your desired weight. Eating the right kind of foods, eating well in the night. Visualize your mental wellness. How are you feeling throughout the day? Visualize that you are calm and peaceful throughout the day, in spite of what is happening around you. But nothing in the outside world is able to affect your emotion. That you stay calm and peaceful in every situation. We are so proud that you have been able to accomplish this. That results in better relationships, higher productivity, more idea generation, more creativity. Now visualize your relationships. See that all your goals. Connected with your relationships, accomplished. that your relationships all the important people in your life is amazing See, there is an amazing bond between all the family members 
and also see that their goals are being accomplished. You want your child to be doing well in the board exam, visualize that he has done very well, he or she has done very well. You can always give energy to your family's goals. They're visualizing. Then take a few moments to visualize your work and your work-related goals being achieved. See that your work is reaching out to more and more people. You're creating excellence in your work. Being rewarded and appreciated for the work you do. And you're accomplishing all your goals, specific goals. We're so grateful to God that all your health, relationships, work, all the goals are being accomplished. Realize that the work is generating enough income for you to fulfill your dreams, your family's dreams. And also go beyond and make a difference to other people's lives. Enough money is flowing into your life. Abundance. Coming from known and unknown sources. And unexpected sources. You have stuck monies, visualize that all your stuck money is getting released and coming to you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Take a moment to visualize the kind of person you have become in the journey. You develop certain skills, some talents some abilities, and you've developed some virtues. Maybe of compassion, maybe of more love and understanding. Maybe of having patience. Very grateful to God for helping you accomplish all your goals. Thank you. Thank you. Let's just pray for the Almighty. Pray to Almighty for all those people who need help right now. Dear God, help those people in my family. Think of all those people who need help right now. Think of your friends, your relatives, people in your network. Pray for all the people in the 5AM family and their family members. Make a specific request to God to send healing energy to all the people on the global healing list. Dear God, please send your healing energy, your unconditional love to all these people. Thank you. 
Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Make a request to send healing to all others on the planet who need healing right now. All the living beings. And visualize that God is sending his healing. Also healing our entire planet. That we are also sending our unconditional love. Visualize the unconditional love flowing from the center of your heart. The form of a beautiful white divine light filling up your entire home. Covering all your loved ones at home. Covering all the people in your office. Further expanding into the city, the state, the country where you are living right now. Further expanding into the continent and then the entire planet. Visualize that your beautiful unconditional love is flowing to every single person. Thank you, thank you. We're going to do a download. So today the download is, I know how to stay focused on my path and create my dreams. I'm focused on building family relationships. They get better every day. Can I download these programs for you? Thank you. Creator of all that is. It is requested that the following programs. I know how to stay focused on my path. And I know how to create my dreams. I know how to stay focused on building family relationships. And I know how it feels see that all my relationships are getting better and better. That these programs are downloaded from the seventh plane and instilled at all cell levels and all belief levels for all the participants who have said yes. And this be done in the highest and the best way. Thank you. It is done. It is done. It is done. Please show me. Witnessing the beautiful divine energy, all these programs. Coming from the seventh plane, falling on all of us like a beautiful shower, like a pot of Entering the body from the crown chakra. Filling up all the 50 plus trillion cells of the body. The programs. Knowing how to stay on path, how to create your dreams, how to stay focused on building great relationships in your family. And also knowing the feeling of how it feels to see your relationship improving every day. This is now instilled at all cell levels and all belief levels. Thank you. It is done. It is done. It is done. Take a moment to create a shield around you. Visualize yourself and say the word shield. And visualize a beautiful divine white light around you with a mirror on the outside surface. This is your shield which is protecting you from any negative vibration from the external world. Visualize your loved ones, your family members. Say the word shield. See a shield around each one of them. Then visualize all your valuables. Whatever is important to you. And say the word You're very grateful to God for always being with you. Thank you, God, for being with me all the time. Thank you, thank you.
Now slowly bring yourself in back into the present moment. Become aware of your breathing. Notice the sounds around you. Notice where your body is touching the chair. And with the awareness that there are 153 beautiful souls who are committed and dedicated to creating a wonderful life. All of them are with you in this beautiful virtual room. Bring yourself in the present moment. Have your hand. And put them on your eyes. Now slowly taking your palms away from your eyes. Opening your eyes. Blink. Smile on your face. Make a wish for the day. Thank you. Thank you. Take a mirror and appreciate yourself for all the wonderful things you are doing. Have a deep sense of appreciation for yourself. Knowing who you are. Love yourself unconditionally. No conditions at all. Because you know who you are. You are not your degrees. You are not your certificates. You are not your body. You are the pure soul. Divine soul. That's the question of any problems. So tell yourself, I love you. I really, really love you unconditionally. Just feel that love for yourself. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And then put your fist out in the air and say, yes! <laughs> I don't know what's going to happen, but it is on the way. Okay, so have a fantastic day, my dear friends. So let's finish up with some learnings. Have a nice hug. Hug yourself. Give a pat on your back. Good job. Good job. Wonderful. Okay, so what's the learning for the day? The learning for the day is, is eat the frog. Okay, this is a concept that was uh, popularized by Brian Tracy in his book, Eat the Frog. So what it does is, what it says is that when we start our day, we have so many things to do. But if we focus on the most important task for the day first, Generally, kya hota hai? Sabse important task hota hai, thoda jada time hai usko. That is why we always put it off. We say we'll do it later, we'll do it later, baad mein karenge, ke baad karenge. Lekin wo kabhi hota nahi hai. According to this principle, you must first do the most important task first. And if you have two important tasks, then usme se bhi jo jada important, usko pehle karo. Now, when you finish the most important task in the morning, what's going to happen? It's got to set the momentum for the day. This is the book. You should read this book. 21 Ways to Eliminate Procrastination. I'm getting more done in less time. So, there are tasks which we know we can, uh, we know can have a great impact on our life. Once they are completed, they can make a really big difference. These tasks are referred to as frogs. Very important tasks. Okay? Not urgent, important tasks. So Eat My Frog is a productivity and a time management strategy which suggests that tackling your most challenging and important tasks of the day first or moving on to the other easier tasks. What this does is, what most people do is they put off this task for later time in the day and mostly it never happens. So that feeling that but when you finish the most important task first, then what happens? It gives you a sense of accomplishment. Wow, I finished this task. 
और सबसे अच्छी चीज है कि मॉर्निंग में आपकी प्रोडक्टिविटी वैसे भी हाई होती है यू नो यू फील सो ऑसम यू डन योर रिचुअल्स यू जस्ट वांट टू गेट स्टफ डन योर प्रोडक्टिविटी इज एट द हाईएस्ट लेवल तो सुबह सुबह वो काम जल्दी भी खत्म हो जाता है तो डू दैट टास्क फर्स्ट एंड देन डू द रेस्ट ऑफ द टास्क इट्स अ ब्यूटीफुल स्ट्रेटजी तो रीड दिस बुक ईट दैट फ्रॉग 21 ग्रेट वेज टू स्टॉप प्रोक्रेस्टिनेटिंग एंड गेट मोर डन इन लेस टाइम so i was reading through all the recommendations of you know for the 5am club and i i think i saw mr ashish pradhan talking about time management so what we'll do is over the next few days we'll cover some time management principles on how to manage your time better what can you do sabke paas 24 ghante hai right aisa to nahi hai ke narendra modi ji ke paas zyada ghante hai unke paas bhi 24 ghante hai है ना बाइडन के पास भी 24 घंटे है रामदेव बाबा के पास भी 24 फोर आवर्स है और हमारे पास भी 24 फोर आवर्स है सो so, अगर वो अपना जीवन मैनेज कर सकते हैं तो हम तो कर ही सकते हैं सो इट इज नॉट अबाउट नॉट अबाउट द टाइम इट्स अबाउट हाउ यू मैनेज योर टाइम हाउ यू यूज योर टाइम इफेक्टिव सो इफ यू डू दैट वेल देन यू कैन बी इन सेंस ऑफ कंट्रोल कैन फील मोर अकम्पलिश्ड यू कैन फील दैट यू नो you be able to balance your life properly you don't feel that stretching feeling every time so all of that can be done when you take pay attention to little bit of time and doing it the right way so we'll cover a few uh, tips on how to manage your time so thank you so much everybody wish you all the best the challenge for you today by the way there must be a challenge hoga yes start following the practice of eating that frog आज से शुरू करो आपका लिस्ट जो बना है ना उसमें देखो सबसे इम्पोर्टेंट टास्क कौन सा है तो उसको पहले करो और चेक करो कैसा लग रहा है आपको so you फेसबुक ग्रुप Plus, a sharing for your experiences, co. So it helps other people also motiv- stay motivated and start doing these things. Be wonderful. So let's say goodbyes to one another. We just unmute everybody. Give me one. Okay. Thank you so much, thank everybody. You, thank you so much. 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 Thank you Bye, Messi. Bye, Sashwati ji. Bye, sir. Thank you, sir. Have a great day, sir. Have a fabulous day. Thank you. You too, sir. You too, sir.